By now, you should have a pretty good idea of what the Pepe Shah feels like. Is it glorious? Duh. Is it good? Uh. Is this weapon gonna be more effective after the wipe? It's pretty hard to say now because everybody's running level 5 armor and higher. And being that this is chambered in 762 by 25, you got two options. PST GZH for armor pen and LRMPC for flesh damage. Does it have a place in Tarkov right now? Yet. However, it's probably gonna feel a lot better after the wipe. It's sold by Prapor at level 2, it's not expensive, doesn't feature any attachments whatsoever, unless we're talking about the drum mags on the day that it was added. Uh, that was disgusting. You know, no matter what, I wanted to give it a go and push it to its limits. So I took a couple of mags and went to interchange in an attempt to hunt the one and only. What you're about to see is one of the most action-packed, boring, emotional roller coasters of a fight. I don't know, bro. Just because of the ammo type. Don't think it's gonna do very well. As I said, Dear God, I'm gonna... Oh, no, no, 
I'm out of ammo! Ah! Oh, that's why he wouldn't die. <laughs> there we go, dude. That's what we need. Yeah, the gun. Okay, so confirmed. The gun sucks versus armor. We got the Ushanka. We're going to take our armor. We're not going to leave it to the Western spies. This guy also has a PPSH. Oh, is that a mandible? What you say, boy? Whoa, 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 what? Yushanka? Dominant? Hat? What? Ah! All right, all right. Now, you didn't possibly think I was going to leave you with a simple, eh, the gun is fine. Just another submachine gun in Tarkov. One thing's for sure. You gotta accept that you can't get in a head-on firefight with a fully geared squad. You're simply gonna get outgunned. What you gotta do with this little mosquito is go full send. But the key word? Outmaneuver. The objective? Find Killa. We kinda succeeded cause he was already dead, but watch what happens. Oh no. No. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bro. Is that Killa down there? Go. Now's my time to swoop in. Whoa! Nope. <gasps> oh, oh. No! Watch my back, Scav! Wait, is that the same squad? Dude, they had the same idea. They went for the flank. That's a USEC with an AK. Let's give this a try. Come on, bro. I'm ready. I'm so ready. Please don't have any more nades. One's by the panels. It's two more at least. Okay. What is happening? Dude, I just killed three. Oh! Never mind. I don't want to play a ring around the rosy with this guy, dude. He's got way better gear. Oh, 
No! Dude, you're boring! Hey! Please, just not now. Okay, yeah, that's an MP7. That's an M4? Wait. Did he just kill our guy? Oh, oh, oh. Oh! Dude, no way. That's a whole nother squad. Alright, what am I to do here? Did they move? That was a good kill. Thank you. I'm screwed. Oh! Oh! No! I didn't see where it came from. Bro! Oh, for real? Well, there you have it. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that this is the best gun in the game, because it obviously is not, but I'm also not gonna tell you that it's completely useless. You gotta move fast, you gotta reposition all the time, but to be fair, that goes without saying. However, being that it's dirt cheap, now you can go full send and not worry about a thing. Think of it this way, try playing the way you don't usually play just because you're not gonna lose anything. Eventually, it'll be worth it. That's all for this video, dudes. Thanks very much for watching and for all the support. We've uh, come a long way. There's still ways to go, but you know, it just means a lot to me. So thanks again, and I'll see you soon. Are you